Hey everyone, I'm Imagination Sports. My name is Rich, and I wanted to share with you one of the craziest things I've ever experienced simulating a Madden season in my life. And I've been simulating Madden seasons since the days of Madden 2002 when it first came out. Um, I play franchise mode a lot. I was playing Madden 06 on Xbox, and I've just never seen anything like this in my life. Um, so, as you can see here, the Cardinals have clinched a playoff spot with the record 7-9. and nine. I'm sure many of you have simulated seasons and have had plenty of teams under 500 make the playoffs. I have. I've had teams win a division 7-7-2 seven, seven and, and make the playoffs. I've had teams go 6-10 and 10 and win their division and make the playoffs. But interestingly, I've never had a team go 7-9 and win a wild card spot. I've had them win the division, but never a wild card spot. And on top of that, there was a 17 tiebreaker that the Cardinals had to go through to clinch a 17 tiebreaker that they clinched this wild card, last NFC wild card spot. And it was just one of the craziest things. I've never seen a tiebreaker this big between this many teams, and I've never had it a team under 500 clinch a wild card spot so i just wanted to share this just something interesting and funny that happens in these older madden games it seems like um if you're interested i'll explain how they actually won the tiebreaker um when you're having a tiebreaker between three or more clubs for a wild card spot the first thing you have to do is if there's any teams in the same division you have to go through the division tiebreakers and eliminate um, the, eliminate teams and you keep yourself with the highest ranked teams from the division. So the first thing we'll do is go to the NFC West. Two of the wild card teams here, Cardinals and Rams. They split the head to head. So the next tiebreaker is division record. The Cardinals had a better division record. So they won that tiebreaker. That eliminates the Rams from being able to clinch that last wild card spot. Now we go to the NFC East. You see the Redskins and Giants. The Redskins actually sweeped the Giants head to head, so they win that first tiebreaker. As you can see, Giants didn't even win a division game. We're gonna go to the NFC South. You can see the Saints and Panthers are tied at seven and nine for the wild card spot. Um, just like the Redskins, the Saints also sweep the head-to-head -head against the Panthers. They also had uh, a really good division record, as you can see there. That eliminates the Panthers. And the Bears were the only team in the NFC North, so they're still qualified by default. So that leaves us with the Cardinals, Redskins, Saints, Bears for the last spot in the wild card. The first tiebreaker um, is head-to-head -head. Um, there's four teams none of the teams um, all played each other so basically the tiebreaker would work is say the Cardinals beat the Redskins Saints and Bears they would automatically win they didn't um, also if one of the teams played the other three and lost they'd be eliminated that didn't happen either so you just go to the next tiebreaker scenario which is conference record as you can see, the Cardinals went six and six in the NFC. The Redskins went five and seven. Saints five and seven. Bears a lousy four and eight. And that is how the Cardinals clinch this last NFC wildcard spot. It's amazing how good met these old Madden games were with the tiebreakers. Um, that's exactly how it would go down in the NFL, and they were true to that in this crazy 17 tiebreaker for a seven and nine wild card spot it just blew my mind i had to make a video and share this um interestingly all the crazy things in these seasons that i usually simulate happen with the cardinals um one season i simulated they went 15 0 and 1 um they've gone 6 and 10 and won a division it's always something crazy in the nfc west just like in real life seahawks won seven and nine but in this case 49ers won the division at 8-8, eight eight. Cardinals won at 7-9, and nine. and they claimed that last wildcard spot. 
as you can see here, they're at the 10 and 6 Vikings. What the heck, let's just simulate and see what happens. And they get destroyed. Deservingly so. As you can see, they did not deserve to make the playoffs, probably. Um, and just one last funny note. Um, in the AFC, of course, 10 and 16 did not make the playoffs. Neither did a few 9 and 7 teams, or even an 8 and 8 team, all better than the 7 and 9 Cardinals, who got absolutely crushed by the Vikings in the wild card round on the road. Although the 49ers did win there. So that's kind of funny. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Just something interesting. Um, tell me something crazy. What do you think the craziest things has ever happened in one of your seasons that you've simulated? Thanks. Bye.